Lachey 2 where we discuss everything Disney and Loungefly. I think we have today three exclusives and one catalog. So let's go ahead and get started. For those of you who are new to the channel, welcome. My name is Shay. We're so glad to have you with us today. On this channel, we do a lot of unboxings, and this time it's no different. So let's go ahead and get started with the first item in our box today. This box, you guys, looks like... Why Funko pick... <coughs> Hold on, y'all. Okay, I think that's it. How come Funko has, I mean, I'm not complaining first, let me say that. But good night, they, they sent us these huge boxes. Now the box that I just opened had these two items in it. And I think I'll open this one first. So you guys, prepare to be sick of me. That's all I'm gonna say. And y'all know if I'm saying that. <laughs> y'all know what that means. It's a little itty bitty bag, y'all. Can y'all tell what it is? A little itty bitty bag. I can't remember how much I paid for this little itty bitty bag, but I hope it went in regular prices. I'm gonna have to carry the bag and a backpack with this little itty bitty thing. So it looks like this. Y'all know what it is yet. It's my daddy, y'all. <laughs> it is my Darth Vader crossbody. Now, you guys, what I'm going to say about this bag is I have a funny feeling it's going to come up on sale because everybody has it. I don't know that it's selling as well as they thought they would, but I needed this for my collection. Y'all know how huge of a dark side fan I am, and I, I just... I, I tried to wait, but I didn't wait. So I know this bag is a crossbody, right? We know that. But in comparison, this this is the backpack, and this is the crossbody. I mean, this is like an itty bitty, and it's kind of thin on the sides in comparison, right? So I don't know. I might have to use this. Literally, usually in my crossbodies, I can fit my water and things like that. I, the only way I could see getting a water bottle in here is if I turn it like like diagonal, so to speak. But anyways, I love this bag though, but it's more to me like a purse size, really. Um, this is a true crossbody size bag. This bag does have a 3D effect, as you can see here, his whole faceplate. You can really see that bulging out from the front of the bag. This bag does not have a front pocket at all you guys so it just has um the images of luke there you can see if i turn it side to side in his eyes of his baby boy and then on the back we have this patent leather um look to the back that has our star wars lounge fly plaque there i wish <laughs> i wish they could have made this bag have some sound you know what I mean? Lounge fly, why y'all didn't get his man a voice? He, I mean, we need some sound. With, I mean, you can't. I mean, you gotta say something. Now I gotta walk around twice. I can't. <laughs> Hardware here is silver. Um, on the inside of this bag, um, I would imagine we have our chain strap, which we do. And it looks like it's just a regular vegan leather strap. Um, it does, yeah, it does have the um, 
buckle to adjust it so it is adjustable. And our inside lining, let's see what we have going on here. So on the inside, guys, you just have images of Darth Vader there holding his lightsaber. I don't know how well you guys can see that. And you have that zipper pocket on the inside, which is good because there's no pocket on the outside of this bag. So there he is there. Say I was kind of surprised by the size. Um, typically in our crossbodies, we get a pretty decent size, but this is truly, it's teeny. Um, like I said, you probably could get a water bottle in if you put it diagonal. But I couldn't imagine myself just taking this to the park alone. I would have to take this and probably this together. But, hey, that would be a cute look too, right? All right, so here's our second bag from in this box. And they actually put this bag inside of the um, dust bag. So let's get this one out. Have you guys been shopping on the uh, lounge fly sale that they have had going on? They have had some really great items. You guys, I purchased something else, and when you see it, you won't believe I purchased it, but it's so cute, I had to get it. Um, make sure, again, if you're not following me on Instagram, to follow me on Instagram, TLW underscore Lachey2. Um, you guys know I post all of the deals on there. Um, any sales that I see upcoming, I post those on there. So here it is, you guys, our next bag. Y'all, it's Bean Bong. <laughs> so, I don't know. It was a, I can't remember which video it was, but I did talk about there is another Bean Bong bag that I wanted that I didn't get. And I haven't purchased it like on the secondhand market or Amazon or anywhere. I think it is still available for decent prices, but I'll post a picture of it. But when I saw they were releasing this one, I was not going to let this one get past. So you guys, here's our little inside out bag. Now I purchased this bag, you guys, because I wanted it to go with my sadness bag that I've shown on a few videos and I've done a short on her. And on this bag, we also have my joy and sadness keychain. So really love that or my bag charm or whatever you want to call it i added that to it so love this bag so um you do have these little on both sides these little coin purses guys and let me open that up and show you so in here you actually could put a a good bit of um things and look at that lining you guys here's a sneak peek at that but you could put your key fob in here your airpods things like that would fit great in here i like that the zipper actually zips towards the front so you don't have to worry about anybody going into your zipper pockets on both of those sides so i love that you have all of the distressed paint here on their wagon that they're in on the front you have your lounge fly Pixar plaque there, really pretty. And um, I think, y'all correct me if I'm wrong, but what do you call these things? The little elements for each of the feelings. <laughs> um, you have that on the zipper pull, so that's really cute. And this front pocket, you guys, finally, I have a front pocket that I would probably use because, look, you can get a good... I mean, it's pretty fairly wide across. Not that deep. It just goes like over half of the bottom of the bag. But you could definitely get a card holder and things like that in that without um, messing up the integrity of the bag. So I love that your hand sanitizer and stuff like that could fit in here. Um, and also, you still, in addition to all of that, these are actual side pockets. Again, really deep. So love that. This bag is really functional. On <laughs> look at that his little nose looks like a heart y'all you see bean bomb with his hat in his hand joy actually has a lot of glitter in her hair if you see that so really cute i love the front of this bag you guys this is so cute and it has all of these um little candies everywhere all across this bag really nice and as you can see we definitely have gold hardware on this one so really pretty on the back of this bag, it has take her to the moon for me, okay? <laughs> so really cute. Oh. How many of you guys have seen this movie? I had, had not seen this movie. I'd say I probably watched it 
maybe last year or the year before one of my good friends she was like you gotta see this movie you gotta see this movie guys it's really a great movie to understand it's okay to not be okay sometimes right i love that movie but you guys the inside lining on this bag oh my goodness look at bean bong enjoy in there and she she looks like she is having the time of her life in that little little red wagon there so cute i love that all that color this is an amazing bag and you have your little slip pocket there on the inside so you guys i am so happy i picked this up i do still low-key want the other one but I feel like I am happy with this one. Especially I feel like I got a two for one with Joy and Bean Bong. And then I like this design. It's so different. I love it. So, you guys, if you are participating in our subscriber appreciation event, go ahead in the comments and tell me which Pixar movie is your favorite. This bag, you guys, came from Pink Alamo. So let's go ahead and get into it and see what we have in this box. Ooh, did y'all see that? Sneak peek of pretty. <laughs> so you guys, it is our mini oil slip bag, y'all. So let's go ahead and get into this girl and see what she looks like. I did pre-order her. She is sold out, but you guys, they introduced a, a Mickey bag that is actually um, available for pre-order now on Pink Alamode if you're interested in that one. It has the same effect, but it is Mickey instead of Minnie. And I think the Mini wallet, which we'll take a look at, is still available for pre-order. So, oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, you guys, so this is our little oil slit mini, and mine is not as perfect as I would like for it to be. I don't know if you can see here, it looks like it's a little scuff, and then there is, you see this little, it looks like a, like a black dot. I don't know if that's a hole or a dot there. So I might reach out to Pink Alamode to see so there it is you can see there if they're able to replace this bag usually they hold back bags for um, imperfections but um otherwise if they're not able to replace it i'll just go ahead and keep it because it is a really pretty bag it's it's a minor um flaw but you know guys for the price that we're paying for these bags like they the quality has to be there and so, as you can see, it's that little scuff there. There's a scuff here at the bottom. So, um, I feel like this bag is going to be kind of like um, the same material of the Tin Man, where it's going to easily be able to get um, scuffed and marked up. So, that's kind of unfortunate. But the bag is really pretty, has a really pretty iridescent sheen to it. And you see this little... Um, I'm sure that's coming from the packaging that probably would fall out but overall it is a really pretty bag I love the iridescence of it of course I love all of the purple I just wish it didn't have that little mark there but I mean it's not something that like would prevent me from using the bag I still think it's really pretty I just think that um I just think that there was just a mishap on this one somewhere either in the packing or when they made the bag, some kind of way it got scuffed up a little bit. And I don't know how you could get that out without um, damaging the bag more. So so the flag here is also giving you that iridescent feel of the oil slick. So that's pretty slick, huh, you guys? Oil slick design actually extends through the bottom as well. So that's really nice. This is a really pretty bag. I love all of the purples that are coming through. You guys know purple's my favorite color. So I'm getting a lot of that in this bag. Uh, really purple and gold. The back of this bag, you have the same, that same effect on the straps. 
Um, there's not, nothing on the back of the bag. Um, again, you don't want to take away from the design by putting too much on here. The buckle here is also that iridescent color, so really pretty. I really love this bag. Um, really nice design. I love all of the, um, I don't know what else to call it, but like the iridescence of the oil slick. Um, it's so pretty. Oh, this is so cute. Well, that's kind of interesting though. It's cute, y'all, but it's interesting. So, on the inside lining, you have that same kind of iridescence going on. But on the inside lining, it's Mickey instead of Minnie. I would have thought it would have been Minnie. That's kind of interesting. <laughs> you do have a zipper pocket. And as you can see, you see that oil slick or that iridescent type of coloring that's going on on the inside of the bag as well. So, really cute. And even you guys, the zipper pulls has that same effect. So we'll see what happens here. I definitely keep y'all posted. But here's our lounge fly bag. And then let's take a look at the wallet. And hopefully <laughs> she made it okay. So you guys, let me do an inspection here on her. And she appears to be perfect. And this is a nice size wallet. This is so pretty, you guys. I love this. I love her bow. It's so pretty. So it's the same oil slick design as you can see. Gosh, that bow is pretty. Um, you have your Disney lounge fly plaque on the back. And our wallet here. Oh, we have the same zipper pull. So really pretty. I love this design, you guys. Um, oh my goodness, look at the inside of this, y'all. I love that. So, like I said, this wallet is still available for uh, pre order, you guys, if you um, didn't get it or you're interested in it. But it is so cute. They do just have a little oval here on their ID face, so that's okay. Um, it don't always have to have an image there. What image would they put? Mini? Mm hmm. Um, I don't know, but I love the way they did the card slots. Really nice. So, love this wallet a lot. Got to keep my energy up for the next one, so we're going to keep going. Now, this bag, you guys, is one that I have been waiting on for almost a year. And it is from 835. It's my first bag from them, and I'm so excited to open this bag, and we're going to hope that this bag is perfect, y'all, because... Ooh, another year to wait. I don't know. And so you guys, I've already opened it up um, as far as like I'm opening the box, but this is what it looks like. All right. So here's our kind of Lux box, right? That 835 is known for it. So they send all of their bags. I think they're exclusive bags in this type of box. I don't know that they do it for bags that are on sale and things like that, but I know their exclusive bags definitely come in this box. And it's like a luxe box. Kind of like if you were buying a designer bag, kind of getting that same feel. So we'll go ahead and open it up. And so it does come, you guys, with a... I'm put this down so I can open it. With a dust bag, it has 835. It feels really good. So, okay, 835, I see y'all. Okay. <laughs> so, here's what the inside of the box looks like. And if you can see there, what I have, another pretty. But we can use this for other things, you guys. Isn't that a nice box? Love that. You know, guys, sometimes when you get a good bag and the quality is in there and the work you know little extra things like this when you have to wait a year it helps the box and the package and the presentation all of that stuff helps to kind of make it a little bit more forgivable sometimes so you guys here's our bag can y'all see what it is now i ordered this bag when it was when when this movie or this show this series was the talk of the time it's game of thrones and, oh yeah, y'all, this is not a kid-friendly uh, series. So if you haven't seen it and you intend on watching it, it's not for kids, okay? Okay. So this bag, you guys, is for my favorite character 
of the series. And it is the Mother of Dragons, Daenerys. Y'all, I've been waiting on this bag. Look, we have... They covered it up. Yes, cover. Okay, then. 835, protecting my eggs. So, it's the little dragon. So, this... Okay. So, if you don't watch Game of Thrones, you're not going to know what I'm talking about. So, just enjoy the pretty bag, okay? But uh, Daenerys was the mother of dragons. So, they had dragons in Game of Thrones that flew, that she commanded, that blew fire. And they were instrumental in a lot of the wars between the different houses in Game of Thrones. So this egg is one of the dragon eggs. And she had to nurture those eggs for a long time before they would hatch. Um, and that's essentially, without giving so too much away, that is essentially her strength and the strength of her house were these dragons. So this bag, you guys, is a uh, representation of the dress that Daenerys wore um, in one of the seasons of the movie. I, it was early on, so I, I mean, of the series. So it was early on, probably like season maybe one or two. But anyway, this was one of the outfits that she wore in the um, movie. And so you see it has this really pretty blue, light blue color. You have this gold, um, almost feels like figury around the bag. And so it goes all the way across the top. It's on the pockets here. But it is definitely another texture that's on top of the actual um, vegan leather of the bag. So really pretty. And then what's so funny is it almost give it like this dragon type look to it. Like if it was an egg. You know what I mean? The scales of it. But I love this bag. It's so pretty in person. You have all of this gold trim. I love this plaque, y'all. It says Game of Thrones Lounge Fly. I love that a lot. Um, there is no design on the back. But you do have these really pretty padded light blue um, straps. So they're really, really pretty there. Our hardware on this bag is gold. Um, you do have your working side pockets with that gold trim and the gold trim around the um zipper the back of this tag actually does say hbo <laughs> so game of thrones so that was the channel that the um, series actually came on it, it is really a good series if you like um vikings and things like that if you like those type of um series you would love this it, it really is good um our inside lining let's take a look at that so the inside lining actually has the emblem for their house um house of targaryen is what it's called but um there you see the dragons and there are three dragons so and that's what she had she had three little dragons and they were cute at first till they grew up and baby you didn't want no piece of them when they grew up <laughs> <laughs> but they took care of their mama and that's all that matters <laughs> this bag is still in stock they are um still releasing some of the other character bags i don't know if i'll get any more i think if this bag would have came in quickly and i was still into the series and the movie was still i mean the show was still going on you know just impulse buying I probably would have got more because I would have been into it. But now that it's over, I don't know. Um, I doubt it. For me, I, don't, I think Daenerys was the one that I really wanted. Really love this bag. Great job, 835. Just wish the timing was a little bit quicker. But I just think that with that small shop, 835, I think they're getting a reputation for the us having to wait a long period of time to get these bags and with that you guys we'll go ahead and wrap up our video for today if you have not had a chance to subscribe to our channel and you like what you see please take an opportunity to subscribe and if you're not ready to subscribe we get that too but if you enjoyed the video please give us a thumbs up we will appreciate that as well and it will greatly help the channel and with that you guys we will see you on our next video. Bye, you guys.